So again, hello everyone. This is Ana Claudia Castro and I have here uh, Mr. Dejalma Morta Arcolo and uh, uh, you probably have seen uh, his presentation uh, about on uh, Jung and the mediumship. And uh, today will be uh, he will be answering questions uh, about that presentation or about the subject. And uh, I do have here some questions that people have already sent uh, in advance. But if you have new questions please use the, the little box that you have at the very bottom of the screen uh, called Q&A. And as far as if, if you have any comment or if you have questions about sound or image or something, please use the other box called chat. So uh, I'll go ahead and start introducing Mr. Dijama and then briefly, and then we'll, we'll start with the questions and answers. Um, so, Mr. Djalma Mota Argolo, he was born in Salvador Bahia, same, same place as I yes. was. So, yeah, yeah, we come to, from the same place. So, he is a Bachelor of Stati Statistics Science and also two courses in, uh, uh, in data processing analysis in uh, Jung, yeah. Jungian yeah. therapy. So he also holds a master degree in in Jungian, Jungian analysis, and uh, Mr. Djalma Mota Argolo he is also a Jungian therapist performing these activities in, uh, in the psychic clinics in Salvador Bahia since what 40 years ago I guess, and uh, he is a spiritualist. Djalma Mota Argolo is psychic medium himself with ability to channel. See and intuition. So yes. thank you for coming. And um, Dijana Motergolo, uh, would you like to say anything? And remember, whatever you say, uh, just say briefly so uh, uh, Sheila can um, uh, do a, 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 she can understand and, and do the, the translation. Okay? Thank you so much. Eu quero, em primeiro lugar, agradecer a oportunidade de estar aqui conversando sobre tanto espiritismo e sobre espírito como right. sobre Jung, a psicologia indiana. Eu quero agradecer a Ana isso e dizer que também é uma alegria estar conversando com todos vocês. Estou pronta a responder as perguntas que me forem feitas e que naturalmente eu saiba responder. I'm very happy to be here today and very thankful for Anna for the invitation. And I'm very glad to be here to be talking about Espiritism with all of you guys. Yeah, one thing I must say, today is a very, very special day because today is his birthday. He's, uh, what, uh, 35 years old or 36? <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, we are very happy uh, for, for to have him as an owner because instead of being within uh, with his family, he chose to be here with us today and uh, you know um, working on, a, on on this very very important topic, right? So I'll go ahead and jump. Uh, let me see. Uh, I'll go ahead and jump to the questions. Just uh, um, okay. I have to take my glasses off otherwise. <laughs> And uh, the very first question we have here is, um, uh, so, so Sheila, I will say in Portuguese because most of these questions, they are in Portuguese, okay? So you please translate for us. Uh, como Jung descreve o que ocorre com o espírito logo após uh, o desencarno? How does Jung explain what happened to the spirit after they pass it away? Naturalmente, a morte é um momento de transição. The death is the moment of transition. E uma transição muito difícil porque envolve, inclusive, medos e perdas. It's a very difficult um, transition because it involves fear and is caring feelings. Naturalmente, a pessoa que está 
desencarnando ou morrendo, ela naturalmente está sob o impacto de fortes emoções. And uh, the moment that the person is passing away, she's going through a moment of deep emotions. Muitas pessoas pensam que o problema maior é para quem fica. Na verdade, não é. A lot of people think that the worst is for those who stay here alive, but actually is not. É claro que quem fica sente a dor da perda. Of course. Da alguma. Of, of course, who stayed feel uh, the longing feeling of missing someone. Mas aquele que está indo sente também, porque quem fica tem muitas vezes o apoio de várias pessoas, enquanto a pessoa que vai está sozinha. But the person who is passing to another home is feeling as well, and because the person who is stay sometimes have the support of other people around it to go through this moment. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, the next one is, uh, como Jung explica o fenômeno da dissociação psíquica? A dissociação psíquica vem de um simples fato. O psiquismo e o corpo têm condições de natureza diferentes. Uh, the psychic uh, dissociation explain. Could you repeat, please? O, tanto o psiquismo quanto o cérebro, o corpo, têm condições diferentes. Okay. Vibrações diferentes. Uh, the psychic, uh, just give me one Sorry, I had an audio issue here. Could you just repeat one more time? É, eu tive um probleminha aqui no áudio. Você pode repetir mais uma vez para mim? Está dando interferência? O psiquismo e o corpo, o cérebro, possuem condições diferentes. Estão interligados, mas possuem uma estrutura muito diversa um do outro. Okay, the psychic and the brain has different connections related to the body, but yeah, it's really, the connection is really bad here for me, the audio. And we can do... Go ahead and translate, I'll mute here. Okay, go ahead and, and, and uh, translate uh, because he, he has done Another year, little trick. Go ahead, Ruth. Can you Go ahead and translate on mute while she translates. She cannot hear us. She's muted. Sheila, can you proceed? Can you hear us? Can you hear us now? Sheila, can you hear us? No, no she's not. I don't know. I don't
Já não, não tô escutando. Ok. Meu áudio tá liberado aqui. Mas eu não tô escutando. O vídeo e a câmera. I can hear you now. Let's check what's going on. Tá, tá, tá aqui meu áudio tá ligado, mas não tô escutando. Será que eu saí André de novo? Eu vou, eu vou, deixa eu escrever de repente, não sei se eles estão me escutando, que eu vou entrar de novo. Sheila, can you hear us? Sheila? How about if we uh, type to everybody um, if they can hear us? Yes, I can hear both of you. Okay, great. Yes. So yeah, so Sheila, she had a problem with her uh, on her end and um, she dropped off and uh, she's working on getting back to the, to the, to the same room. So she said she can't hear you guys, but I, okay, yeah, thank you guys. Yes, okay, so definitely then we know it's a problem on her end and uh, hopefully she will be, she will be back. But um, could you please repeat what you said? So, so we can continue Acontece que o psiquismo e o corpo têm estruturas diferentes, embora estejam interligados. Ok, happens that the, the, the psychic body and the physical body, they have different structure, although they are interconnected. Exatamente. Então, eles podem ser dissociados. O psiquismo pode separar-se do corpo. So they can be dissociated, disconnected. The psychic body can be disconnected from the physical body. Ele pode estar desligado, mas eh, separado, desculpe, mas ligado. Por exemplo, ele pode estar vivendo uma experiência fora do corpo e pode transmitir essa experiência pelo corpo, embora esteja em outro lugar. So, although it can be separated, but uh, the, the psychic body can uh, transmit uh, information or messages to the physical body from other dimension? Sim, de outra dimensão, que a dimensão psíquica está além da matéria. Because the psychic dimension is beyond the, the physical dimension, the, the, the physical, the, the matter. E embora o psiquismo esteja ligado ao sistema nervoso, although the psychic body is connected to the nerve system, ele pode transitar numa dimensão superior àquela que é a nossa. It can, uh, it can uh, go to, uh, it can go to a higher or another dimension. Uh, other than the ones that we are in. Exatamente. E quando acontece isso, ele não está no lugar do corpo sempre. So when when that happens, uh, then uh, the, uh, it doesn't it doesn't necessarily stay or is in the same body or in this body in this physical body. Eu, por exemplo, como espírito Posso estar ao lado do corpo. Me, for example, as a spirit, I can be uh, beside my own body. E parece que eu estou dentro do corpo, mas não. 
And it looks like I am in my body, but in reality I'm not. É porque as dimensões são diferentes. O psiquismo normalmente está em quatro dimensões. Because the, the, they may be in different dimensions and for example, the psychic body uh, can be up to uh, four dimensions. Enquanto o corpo está em três. While the body uh, may be situated or located in three, in three dimensions. Por isso, é, eles vivem situações um tanto diferentes. That's why they actually experience different uh, situations. O espírito pode se movimentar por vários lugares. The spirit can uh, move within different uh, locations. Embora ligado ao corpo. Although connected to the body. Inclusive existem experiências com pessoas que aparecem o corpo num ponto e o espírito em outro. So that's why we see uh, some in some situations when the body uh, may be seen in a location, but the spirit or the soul can be in another uh, location, can be seen in another location. Na Inglaterra houve uma professora. In the UK there was a, a teacher. Chamada Emilio Sager. Uh, called Emil Sage, Sage, que foi posta para fora de várias escolas. <laughs> There was expelled from several schools. Porque muitas vezes aparecia ela e o duplo, ou seja, o psiquismo ou o espírito ao lado. Because for several occasions, she, uh, her her soul, her spirit was seen. Uh, beside her, her body, so it was a very weird vision for everybody to, to see her physical body uh, besides her soul. Algumas vezes ela estava na sala de aula e ao mesmo tempo era vista no lado de fora da sala de aula. Sometimes she was seen uh, in a classroom, and, uh, but at the same time she, she, she could be seen outside in another location outside the classroom. Isso causava um pavor aos alunos. That was very weird and was scaring the students. E ela, coitada, perdia muitas vezes o emprego. And that's why she, she ended up uh, losing a lot of jobs. Nós funcionamos em várias dimensões. We, we, uh, we act in several dimensions. We can function in several dimensions. Agora mesmo, eu estou aqui falando com vocês. Right now, at this moment, I'm here talking to you. Mas eu posso também estar em outro lugar, entrando em contato com outras pessoas, inclusive espíritos. But I can also be in another dimension, talking to, uh, or realm, talking to other beings, or spirits. Logo. É natural o, o psiquismo e o corpo se dissociarem. So, uh, it's very natural that the physical body and the psychic uh, body uh, can be disconnected. Okay, so, so the next question here is, okay, I have here some uh, questions in English as well. So, and uh, this one says, um, could you please give us examples of synchronicity? And then there is a comment. You know that uh, will help people uh, to know or believe that there are other forces helping us. Example, three seats on three planes with mom and baby. Uh, então, ela está pedindo exemplos de sincronicidade. E a que ponto isso poderia uh, ajudar people, uh, uh, pessoas uh, ou ajudá-las ou uh, deixá-las crer que isso, na verdade, vem como uh, algo, uma ajuda do, do, de forças espirituais? A sincronicidade é um fenômeno que acontece com o psiquismo, o inconsciente no psiquismo. The synchronicity is a phenomenon that can uh, that can help with the psychic uh, body or the in, 
Inconsciousness. É, acontece automaticamente. It happens automatically. Nós não é, desenvolvemos uma, uma ação para ter sincronicidade. We do not develop uh, an action so in order to uh, have a synchronicity. Ela nos acontece. It just happens. Porque nós estamos interligados. Because we are interconnected. Principalmente com pessoas que estão ligadas diretamente ao nosso afeto. Um, uh, com pessoas que estão ligadas. Especially uh, with people uh, with the beloved ones. Isso. Então, é, essa ligação permite que haja uma comunicação inconsciente. So this this interconnection uh, allows us uh, to uh, to connect to the unconsciousness. Muitas vezes nós estamos então, no trabalho. Several times we are in the at, at work in our offices. E nos vem um sentimento de que um filho um marido, uma esposa, está nesse momento passando por uma situação difícil. And then uh, a feeling um, com, comes up, uh, giving us uh, an intuition that a, a, a son or a husband or a beloved one is uh, having a, a bad experience or uh, is involved in a bad situation. Ernesto Bozano escreve no livro sobre eh, os animais, que o título é Os Animais Têm Alma? So, Ernesto Bozano uh, has, or wrote a book, uh, what is it? So, about, os Animais Têm Alma? About the, whether the, the animals have a soul or not. Nesse livro, ele descreve, inclusive, In this book, Uh, he describes Inclusive, as well é, ligações desse tipo de, com animais. Uh, about connection of this type with uh, animals. Pessoas que têm um cão, por exemplo, de estimação e que está morrendo em algum lugar. Uh, people that has for example a dog um, and uh, which is dying eles sentem que o animal está morrendo como se houvesse uma transmissão telepática entre os dois okay so the dog is dying and then this person the donor uh, feels like uh, exactly that same uh, feeling at the moment so um, that's a proof that there is a very connection, a, a, a bond between the dog and the dog. Isso é uma interação psíquica. So this is a psychic interaction. Agora, sincronicidade. Now, synchronicity. Ela acontece. Happens. Sem haver. Without. Uma, uma causa e um efeito. A cause and effect. São situações da seguinte maneira. Those are situations of the following uh, de forma, maneira. Uh, form. Uh, Eu levanto de manhã. I wake up in the morning. E vou pegar um livro. And I will uh, pick up a book. Ele cai ao chão. It fell down. E se abre. And opens up. E os meus olhos and batem. And my eyes. Go Lei. straight to the page and read. Um nome. A name. Digamos, João. Let's say John. Nada demais. Nem pensamos mais no assunto. Not a big deal, we don't think about it. Saímos de casa, vamos para o trabalho. We get out our houses and then we go straight to our offices. E ao passar por nós um ônibus. And as we cross... Uh, a bus, nós vemos escrito we see, uh, written, 
numa, no outdoor do ônibus, on a net, o nome João. The name John. Nada demais até agora. Ok, not, not a big deal. Passa-se o dia. So then the day passes by, the hours passes by. E à noite, nós recebemos um telefonema. And then at night, we receive a phone call. De um amigo chamado João. From a friend called John. Que não vimos há 10 anos. That we didn't see for many, many years. Isso é que se chama sincronicidade. So this is synchronicity. Porque não existe uma ligação causal. Because there is no... Um, Oh, how, how do I say? Causal. <laughs> there is no uh, connection um, um, cause e of cause and effect Entre o João do livro. between the John uh, of that book, o João do ônibus, the John on that uh, ad on the bus, e o João que nos telefona. and the John, the friend who called us. Mas chama a atenção que todos três são o João. But it calls our attention that all of them, all the three of them, they call, Isso. call the same way. Isso é uma sincronicidade. So this is a synchronicity. Eu contei outro dia. I told another day. Que um dia, há anos atrás. That once, many, many years ago. Eu atendi duas moças. I had two ladies in my office, in my clinic. E elas estavam com problemas com crianças. And they had uh, issues with their uh, children. Their children. Não queriam ter crianças. They, they ter didn't. Filhos. So they didn't want to, to have uh, children by their own. Saí do atendimento. So he finished that, fui, that appointment. E fui tomar um avião. And then he, he went to, uh, to the airport for uh, a flight that he had that, that, that time. Eu estava, eu estava em Ilhéus, Bahia. So he was in Ilhéus, a city in Bahia. Ia para Manaus. So he was flying to Manaus, another city in Brazil. E primeiro ele tinha que ir a Salvador. And then he had to go first to Salvador city. Peguei o avião quando eu entrei. So as he got into that uh, aircraft. No meu lugar. On his seat, estava sentada uma mãe com um filho recém-nascido no colo. There was a lady with uh, a, a, her um, born son, her uh, baby son. Naturalmente, sentei em outro lugar. So naturally, he looked for another seat too. Chegando a Salvador. So as he arrived in Salvador City, they landed. Fiz uma troca de aeronaves. So he um, he was ready to go to another aircraft for the next flight. Ao entrar na aeronave, as he got in to that uh, aircraft, no lugar onde ele ia sentar, that that again on the same seat he was about to he was supposed to be sitting in. Estava uma mãe com um filho pequeno no braço. There sentado. was a mother again with a son on her lap. Troquei de lugar de novo. So, he, again, he looked for another seat for him. Fui para Brasília. So, he went to Brasília, another city in Brazil. Para fazer uma conexão para Manaus. For a... Uh, 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 how do we call a conexão? Change of to, 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 to get another flight to Manaus. Ao entrar na, na conexão... So as he got to that flight, no meu that lugar, aircraft, um, again on his seat for the third time, estava sentado uma mulher, there was a lady, com uma criança pequena nos braços, with, a, with, a, with her son uh, again on her lap. So, Eu disse que ela ficasse no lugar, fui para um outro pé. So again, he, he allowed that lady to stay in his seat and then he was looking for Another set for himself. Ela virou-se para mim e me disse. So she, she turned to him, back to him and, and asked him. O senhor vai ficar em que hotel em Manaus? Which hotel are you staying in Manaus? Eu disse, não sei, porque eu estou com um convidado. He said, no, I don't know because I've been invited to Manaus. I do not know the hotel I will stay in. 
Ela disse, eu sou dona do Hotel Da Vinci. So she said, I'm, I'm the, own, uh, the owner of the Da Vinci Hotel. Se o senhor for ficar lá, eu lhe darei um desconto na diária. If you are staying in, I will give you a discount and on, on, the, on, the, on, the, on that hotel. Chegando a Manaus. So as he arrived in Manaus. Eu perguntei quando desci do avião as pessoas que me eh, esperavam. I asked uh, the people that who were there at the airport to take me to the hotel. Onde eu ia ficar? Where I was supposed to stay in? No Hotel Da Vinci. So they answered Hotel uh, Da Vinci Hotel. Vocês vão me perguntar. So you asked me. O que significava essa sincronicidade? What does that synchronicity mean? Porque é, é uma probabilidade muito difícil. Because there is a very rare probability. Tomar um, dois, três, quatro aviões. Take four flights. Em todos os aviões no meu lugar. And in all of them. Uma, mãe, seat, uma mãe com um filho pequeno nos braços. Ok, so in all of them, I have somebody, I have a, a mother and a children uh, and, and a son or daughter uh, on her lap, uh, sitting on my place. On my e ainda a, a última, me falar que era dona de um hotel da Vinci. And exactly the last one said, uh, tell me that she is the owner of the Vinci Hotel, the same hotel I was supposed to stay in. Mas como toda sincronicidade. But as all synchronicity occasion. Aponta para alguma coisa que vai acontecer. Point towards something that is going to happen. O que aconteceu depois disso? What did happen after this? Houve uma grande mudança em minha vida. There was a huge transformation in my life. Um recomeço. A new restart. De toda a minha vida em Salvador of my entire life in Salvador City. E nesse período, and, and in that period, eu comecei a ser inspirado pelo espírito de Leonardo da Vinci. Okay, that's awesome. So, I, I, I started being inspired by the Vinci uh, spirit. Inclusive, um livro meu chamado Possibilidades Evolutivas. And, um, There, so, in addition to that, there is a, a book that I wrote called Possibilidades Evolutivas. Uh, uh, Evolutive. Evolutive Possibilities. Sim. Foi inspirado por ele. The, uh, it was inspired by him. Então, toda a sincronicidade. So, all synchronicity. Aponta para algo que vai acontecer. Points to something that will happen em nossa vida in our life diferente daquilo que eu disse no início so which is different from what i i, I started saying today que é a interação psíquica which is the psychic interaction onde existe causa e efeito where there is cause and effect uma pessoa ligada a mim ou um animal ligado a mim uh, a person uh, connected to me or an animal connected to me está passando por uma situação difícil is passing by a difficult times e eu sinto aquilo no mesmo momento and then i feel that at the same time e compulsivamente sou levado ao encontro da pessoa and, ou do animal and instantaneously i am uh, i am guided uh, to the thought of that person of or that animal. So, essa tem significado. So this is the meaning. Mas a sincronicidade, o significado só vem depois. So there is a meaning, but the synchronicity, the meaning of the synchronicity, will learn only after. Okay. So first of all, I uh, I apologize for my poor translation. I'm not interpreter. But uh, we had a problem here with the interpreter. She just texted me. She said that um, there was a, a, a power shutdown in her building for, 
for the very first time and she's desperately trying to to get connected back to us but uh in the meantime i apologize but we'll have to move on and uh sorry guys you have you stick with my poor translation i apologize for that um so the next question is is deja vu in your opinion or the union world view past life remembers so uh, a question is se déjà vu, na opinião do Djalma, ou no mundo junguiano, é uma, uma prova de, de, de vidas passadas, de memória de vidas passadas. Pode ser ou não. It can be or not. Por quê? Maybe or not. Por quê? Nós recebemos atualmente muitas informações. Because uh, today uh, we receive several information. Os filmes. Uh, televisão through, through movies, TV shows, internet, internet, e vemos lugares do mundo inteiro. And we see uh, uh, places from the, the whole world. E pode acontecer. And it can happen, or it may happen. Uma criptomnésia. Oh, gee. <laughs> criptomnésia. <laughs> a a criptomnésia. A criptomnésia The foi algo aprendido ou visto. It is something that has been learned or seen que ficou no profundo da memória. That was retained deep uh, in your memory. E esquecemos And then we just forget about dela. We just forget about. E o que acontece num determinado momento? And then what happens at, at, at certain moment? Motivado por algum fator externo? Motivated or triggered by a, an external fact? A memória retorna à consciência. The memory comes back to the consciousness. Mas você está ligado ao fato anterior. Without being connected to the past fact. Por exemplo. For example. Eu posso estar num país que eu estou visitando. I can be in this uh, country I'm visiting now. E na minha infância ou juventude. And in my childhood. Well, yeah. Eu ter visto um filme. I could, I could have seen a movie. Que se passa numa determinada localidade. Okay, I, I saw a movie in my childhood that was uh, which story um happens in that same city I am visiting now. E naquele momento, no lugar, and in that moment, in that location, eu começar a sentir que é conhecido o lugar. And then I feel like that per, that place is known to me. Isso é uma criptomnese, uma memória oculta. So this is a cryptomnese. This is a, an occult memory. Um déjà vu de outras existências. A déjà vu from another or, for, or from a past life. Seria uma vivência completa. It could be a complete experience. De algo que foi realmente vivido naquele lugar. From something or a, 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 a situation that was in fact Uh, lived in that place. Normalmente, Normally, nós sentimos que aquilo aconteceu. We feel like that really happened. Que nós estivemos realmente ali. That we were or we have been exactly there. E que vivemos uma situação emocional qualquer. And then we, we live over there uh, an emotional situation, any, any type of emotional situation. Tem vários, várias nuances nisso, várias mudanças nisso. There are uh, a wild range of... Uh, no fenômeno. Uh, uh, type of situation in this case. Isso. Eu posso sentir simplesmente que já estive ali realmente. I can just feel like I was... I have been there. Como posso reviver o que aconteceu? 
uh, but also vez. I can I can feel Na like mente. I'm living this again in my mind. Então há uma diferença portanto. So there is a difference in that way. É, existem casos, inclusive, dessas memórias ocultas ou criptomnésia. There are cases of this cryptomnésia or uh, occult memory. No campo da arte. Uh, in the field of art. Onde pessoas foram acusadas de plágio. When people was uh, was uh, oh gosh I forgot how to acusado uh, was. Um, When, when somebody uh, was uh, said that... Tidas uh, como plagiadores. Yeah. Uh, when somebody was said that, uh, that they copy somebody else's uh, work or text or book or something. E um de conta um caso interessante. So there is a very interesting case about it. Ele lia o Assim Falava Zaratustra de Nietzsche. Uh, 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 Assim falava Zaratustra. Não, você leu o Carlos? Não, Jung leu. Oh, yeah. Ok. So, Jung read a, a book called. Assim falava Zaratustra. Zaz speaks Zaratustra. Ok. So, that's, that's how speak uh, Zaratustra. E viu numa passagem determinada. And he saw in a, in a specific paragraph que o Zaratustra vem voando e entra no vulcão. That Zaratustra, he comes flying in and then he gets into a volcano. E ele se lembrou. And then he uh, recalled. Que o, foi citado por Justino Kerner. That uh, Justino Kerner uh, mentioned. Um alemão, escritor, cientista. Uh, Justino Kerner being a German uh, writer and scientist. Que estudou uma mulher chamada Frederica Ralph. That uh, studied of a woman called uh, Frederica Ralph. Ralph. Que era uma médium. And, and she was a medium. E nos casos que ele cita. And in, that, in those cases. De fenômenos mediúnicos. Um, that uh, uh, who is who is mentioning in those cases? Jung. So in, in the cases that Jung is mentioning, uh, mediumistic cases, uh, Jung is mentioning. Houve um caso. There was a case. Em que um viajante que estava em Stromboli, a which, ilha de Stromboli. In which uh, um, a traveler. That was a Stromboli, na Itália. Oh, in Stromboli, a city in Italy. Isso, que é uma ilha. Which is a, an island. É, eles viram dois amigos que vinham voando e entravam no vulcão. They saw two friends flying, uh, and all of a sudden they got into a volcano. E um me mandou perguntar à irmã de Nietzsche. And then you uh, ask Nietzsche's sister. Nietzsche havia morrido. Nietzsche uh, was deceased by then. Se ele tinha lido Justino Kerner. If he read Justino Kerner. E ela mandou dizer. And she sent her a note. Uh, she sent him a note. Que saying é, na, aos 12 anos de idade. That when she was 12 years old. Ele havia lido tudo o que Justino Kerner escrevia. Oh, uh, when he was uh, 12 years old, he read everything about Justino Kerner. Logo, utilizar a imagem As such, using the image da pessoa entrando no vulcão of a person getting into a volcano não tinha sido um plágio. It was not a copy. Um, Mas uma memória oculta que voltou. But uh, an occult memory that came back. Quando ele estava adulto, when, muito tempo. When he was uh, an adult person. Okay. So, uh, so the, da, the, the next question then is, um, is déjà vu in your opinion of Jung 
Indian worldview uh, could be an active brain processing information before it happens. Sim. Yes. Pode ser uma clarividência. It can be a, a clairvoyance. Eu vou, eu, eu vou viajar para algum lugar. I, I, uh, if I want to travel to another place. E a ansiedade. And uh, my anxiety feeling, anxiety. Pode fazer com que eu perceba inconscientemente. Uh, may, uh, may cause. Perceber. May cause me to uh, perceive. Sempre isso. É, o lugar que eu vou. A place, the, the place I'm going to. Como também pode acontecer. In the same way, it may happen that que, que à noite eu me liberando do corpo. At night, when I uh, experience an out of body experience, eu posso ir ao lugar. I can go to that place. Ver a localidade. See everything. Gravar isso. Uh, record that in my mind, in my memory. E quando chegar no lugar. And when I get that, uh, when I get to that place, actually. Aquilo que foi percebido pelo espírito. Everything that was perceived by the spirit. Vi a minha consciência. Comes back to my consciousness. É portanto possível sim. So it is possible, yes. Um, you remembering or being told you are at the right moment and place in your life as you planned with your guides on the other side before you come here? Você entendeu? Você se lembra de, ser, de, ter, de, de alguém ter lhe dito que você estava no momento correto, na hora correta uh, em sua vida, de acordo com um plano é, Uh, formado pelos seus guias do, do outro lado, ou antes de você ter vindo, ter nascido? Sem dúvida. Yes, without a doubt. Por exemplo, me foi dito. So, for example, it had been told, uh, somebody told me. Na minha juventude. Uh, in my uh, uh, youth. Que eu seria um escritor. That I was, uh, I was supposed to be a writer. E que teria assumido essa condição ou esse compromisso? So, uh, as such, I, uh, I accepted a, a, a commitment, I, I, I was committed to... Antes de encarnar. To this, before uh, this incarnation. Mas eu não senti em mim nenhuma tendência a escrever. But I never felt in me uh, any desire to be a writer. Isso me foi dito quando eu tinha 18 anos de idade. So that was told to me when I was 18 years old. E na verdade, eu fui começar a escrever livros. In fact, I just started writing books. Com 45 anos. When I was 45 years old. Ou seja, eu yes, tinha esqueci, é, eu, eu me esqueci completamente dessa revelação. In other words, I forgot about this revelation completely. E só me lembrei quando o meu primeiro livro, chamado Encontro com Jesus. And I just uh, I recall that uh, when I was writing my first uh, my first book, uh, Meeting with Jesus. Foi publicado. Uh, when that book was was published or was launched. Ou seja, o compromisso assumido. In other words, the commitment that I That I had Aconteceu. Happened. E hoje eu já tenho 24 livros publicados. And now I have 24 books uh, launched or published. Okay, so, uh, thank you. What uh, compelled you to merge uh, psychoanalysm and mediumship? Bem, a análise Okay, so, so there is more. Uh, did it help him to help his patients? If so, how? Do you use this in your practice? Vejam bem. Oh, okay, so. Uh, Eu não let's see. pratico a mediunidade. I do not uh, use my mediumship. 
enquanto faço análise do meu paciente. While I am uh, helping my patient, while I am doing the, the analysis. Todavia eu sou médium. Although I'm medium. E naturalmente posso receber inspirações. And naturally I can receive some uh, inspiration. E perceber coisas. And perceive uh, other things que acontece com o paciente to the, to my patient, sem ter uma condição aparente de saber. Without, uh, any, um, uh, isso acontecia também com Jung. So this also to Jung. Mas isso pode ser explicado de duas maneiras. But this can be in two ways. Eu receber uma informação I receive an information, mediúnica, uh, mediumistic information, ou, or, o meu inconsciente perceber, my unconsciousness uh, a, perceives, aquilo que acontece com o paciente, something that happens to the patient. Uma coisa que acontece comigo, something that happens to me, muito naturalmente, very naturally, é ao começar a sessão is uh, that whenever I start my uh, my appointment with the with the patient, ao começar a conversar, as we start talking, vira alguma história na minha mente. Uh, sometimes a story comes to my mind. E eu conto para o paciente. And I tell my patient. E vou é, falando sobre o assunto. And uh, as I talk about the subject. E repentinamente eu pergunto. All of a sudden I ask. O que é que essa história tem a ver com você? What does that this story have to do with you? E ele começa a me dizer. And then he starts to say. Que com ele aconteceu algo semelhante. That with him something very similar happened. Com Jung tem um caso célebre. Uh, with Jung there is a remarkable case. Ele estava num jantar. He was in a dinner. Onde foi apresentado uma pessoa a ele? When he was introduced to a person. Naquele momento. At that moment. Não conhecia antes. He didn't know that person before. E a pessoa faz uma pergunta a ele. And the person asked him a question. De cunho psicológico. Um, a question um, from the psychological uh, about psychological uh, uh, topics. E ele começou a contar uma história criada no momento. And then he started talking a, a story that he created at that moment. Para explicar o fato. To explain the fact. E enquanto ele falava. And while he was talking. Em torno da mesa se fazia um silêncio absoluto. Around the table there was a... a, 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 a Huge. Um silêncio tumular. <risos> There was a huge moment of silence. <risos> e ele foi vendo que havia um constrangimento. And he saw that people around the table they they became embarrassed. Terminada a história. As he, uh, whenever he finished that this story. Já havia terminado o jantar. The dinner was over. Ele então saiu para fumar. So, so he 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 got up uh, so he could smoke. E uma pessoa e uma pessoa da mesa foi até ele. And somebody that was present in the table uh, uh, when or uh, walked out to meet him. E disse lhe como você faz uma coisa dessa. And then uh, that person told him how do you do or asked him how do you do something like this. How? It's okay. And he said, what? Você expôs a vida do, do homem. He exposed uh, that gentleman's life. Ele disse, mas eu inventei essa história agora. But, and then he said, but I just created that story. O que pode ter acontecido? So, what actually did happen? O inconsciente dele captou a situação do homem que perguntou. His unconsciousness uh, captured uh, the situation that actually happened to, to the other gentleman. Ou pode ter recebido uma informação mediúnica, uma inspiração para isso. 
or he may uh, it may be that he received uh, that information from another spirit through his mediumship or he was told through uh, by a spirit about that story. Eu falo assim porque eu não tenho como saber o que de fato aconteceu. I say that just because I just don't know exactly what happened. Nem ele explicou. And he never explained how he came up with that fictitious story. That actually was a real story. It <laughs> became to be a real, a real story. Okay, so um, let's see. Do we have a few minutes? It seems like we have a, a, a question here. Um, I would like to know how we, uh, although ignorance, how we can uh, see or uh, feel when synchronicity uh, occurs. And uh, because I don't, I cannot make that uh, easy, I cannot come up with an easy connection uh, between mothers and children uh, and your contact with Leonardo da Vinci. Okay. O problema é o seguinte. The problem is, is that. O que acontece que vem do inconsciente. What happens with the unconsciousness. É sempre simbólico. Is always a, a, a symbology. Como acontece nos sonhos. As for example, at as happens to, to the dreams. Toda aquela situação All the situations era um simbolismo all the, that situation was like a symbology de que algo havia surgido that something actually happened na minha vida in my life novo uh, that was new to me e que ia se desenvolver and then it was uh, and it was uh, it was just it uh, uh, se desenvolver yeah uh, a, it was supposed to to start uh, happening at that moment evolving at that moment e iria crescer ou seja minha vida ia mudar and it was supposed to 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 get even bigger uh, in another words my life was about to change drastically um mês depois desse evento, a month later after that event, eu recebi um convite inesperado. I received an invitation, an expected invitation, para realizar um trabalho to work on, que me levava a mudar de cidade. To work on something that was supposed to, to be done in another city. E desenvolver uma atividade and develop a, a, an activity completely new completely new to me onde eu cresci muito where uh, I, i grew up a lot where e que, e que era ministrar cursos and that was um, to um, to uh, engage in workshops na área Jungiana, on that Jungian que eu não pensava em fazer. Which I never thought to do before. Paralelamente, and, uh, and at the same time, eu comecei no trabalho espírita. I started on the spiritist center. Ao fazer palestras, to do uh, lectures, receber uma inspiração. And when I was doing them, I was receiving uh, inspirations. E um amigo meu José Medrado. And then a friend of mine, José Medrado. Grande médium. He's a, a, a very talented medium. Começou a ver junto a mim. He started seeing close to me. O espírito de Leonardo da Vinci. The spirit of Leonardo da Vinci. E vocês devem estar lembrados que o hotel chamava Da Vinci. And as you remember, the hotel in that situation was called Da Vinci. Em homenagem a Leonardo da Vinci. In honor to Leonardo da Vinci, the inventor. É muita coincidência. So it was a lot of coincidence. Mas não tem uma conexão causal. But there is no uh, cause causal. effect or cause hmm. consequence effect connection. Yes. Okay. So uh, that is that it? Yes. Any other? 
Oh, see, you can speak English. Why am I translating to you? <laughs> so the next question is, um, how, uh, how and why the regressive, I guess, the, or the EBP, the, the, the past life therapy, mm -hmm. uh, can help somebody with uh, a trauma or with a neurose? Fazendo com que a pessoa... Um, uh, uh, causing... Uh, uh, say, say the whole thing and then I will translate. Fazendo com que a pessoa... É, 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 Helping the person... Ter conhecimento do fato que gerou o problema. To become aware of the fact that caused the issue. Que ele vive atualmente. Uh, that he lives today. E que não aconteceu nessa existência. That didn't happen in this lifetime. Mas em outra existência. But in the past, in the past life. É, pessoas, por exemplo, que apresentam uma dor num determinado lugar. So let's take, for example, somebody that feels a pain in a certain part of the body. Que aconteceu numa idade determinada. And that happened at a certain age. Mas que os médicos dizem não ter nada que possa motivar aquilo. But the doctors they don't see a reason why that person is feeling the pain. E numa regressão. And but when then during a, 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 a past life uh, regression. Verificar que tinha sofrido um trauma justamente naquele período cronológico. But then the, the, during that, uh, that uh, experience of uh, uh, past life experience uh, memory, uh, whenever she, the person uh, reached that memory, she verified or he or she verifies that uh, uh, something happened to her or to him. And that's there in a past life, and at the very same age, something happened to him or her that caused a terrible pain, that same pain. E a recordação serviu como motivo para passar a dor. And the remembrance uh, serves as a reason to seize that pain. So, could you please explain how uh, that 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 actually happens why the the memory of something that happened to me before why just uh, the knowledge is enough to seize the pain now porque a pessoa entrou em contato because the person uh, uh, gets in contact com um complexo que tinha de resolver with the complex that he was he or she was supposed to solve. E buscando a terapia. And looking for that kind of therapy. Resolveu. Uh, it got resolved. E resolvendo a dor passou. And as he or she resolved uh, the issue, then the, the pain was was seized. Era algo que ela tinha que trabalhar. It was something that he or she had to work on herself. Em sua existência. Herself. In, in his or her existence. Okay, so, uh, okay, that's a good one. Uh, how does Jung see the karma uh, issue? Hmm. Como é que Jung vê a questão do karma? Ah, e ele vê muito. Ele yes. fala, inclusive, sobre karma. He, uh, Jung does talk about karma. Como sendo justamente algo as uh, being something que vem a nós that comes to us motivado por atitudes e ações passadas motivated by something that we have done before Jung conhecia profundamente Jung knew deeply about o, o, as doutrinas hindus the Hindu um, um, knowledge inclusive Ele fez um seminário. So he did uh, a, a seminar to the point that he did a seminar. Que tem um título. Uh, which is called. 
Psychology of Kundalini Yoga. Which was called Psychology of Kundalini Yoga. E, e, no livro, and in that book, or oh, in the book about it, ele descreve he describes todo o processo de ascensão do Kundalini. All the process of Kundalini uh, evolution or do chakra básico from the basic chakra até o chakra Sahasrara. Holy. Yes. <laughs> Up to the, the chakra over here. <laughs> <laughs> E descreve isso psicologicamente. And he describes this psychologically. Mostrando o link. Showing the connection. Entre. Between. Essa ascensão. This evolution. Entre o conhecimento hindu que descreve. Between the Hindu knowledge. E o desenvolvimento da pessoa. And development of the person em direção ao, ao crescimento pessoal bem grande. Towards uh, her or his um, um, desenvolvimento pessoal bem grande. Self development. Isso, inclusive espiritualmente. Including talking about spiritual uh, spiritually. Okay, so so I will take uh, one last question mm -hmm. and uh, let's see something over here. Um, uh, what is the difference between uh, uh, the? I do not know how to. Uh, do you know how to? Você uh, dividido. The libido, okay. De Freud Jung? Yes, but ah. I do not know how to, to translate libido. Libido. The libido is libido in English, é. you know? Okay, so what is the difference between the concept of libido uh, between Freud and Jung? That's, that's Para question. Freud. So, to, uh, to Freud. A libido. The libido. Como o próprio nome indica. As the, the name uh, uh, says itself, Era uma energia sexual. it was a sexual energy. Uma pulsão sexual. Uh, pulsão. I do not know how to say that. Energia pulsão. sexual. So it was a sexual energy. É, que era usado pelo psiquismo. That was used by the psychics. Para realizar. To uh, realize, not, not to realize, to to uh, to do uh, Isso, uh, uh, ev events. Isso. Todos os eventos psíquicos oh. e existenciais. Oh, okay. To to uh, to do all the the psychic events uh, and existenciais and existential events. Mm -hmm. Então, era uma energia de base sexual, que libido tem esse significado. It was an energy from a sexual... Uh, base, de uma base that, sexual. Yeah, that has a sexual uh, foundation or a base. Para Jung é diferente. So, to Jung is a different, uh, there is a difference. A libido é uma energia psíquica. The libido is a psychic energy. Que, inclusive, that, uh, also é usada do ponto de vista sexual. Is used from the sexual perspective. Mas não tem na sexualidade sua origem. But it doesn't uh, origin from the, the sex. From the sex itself. Então, existe uma diferença fundamental aí. So, there is a, a very basic difference Nos dois conceitos. Into, between the two concepts. Para Freud, so to Freud, essa energia this energy é uma pulsão, um impulso is an impulse, sexual. A sexual impulse. Para Jung, okay. não. So to Jung, no, it's not. É uma energia psíquica it is a psychic energy, que é usada, inclusive, para a função sexual, mas não vindo dela. That was used um, uh, 
by the as a as a function of the sex. the sexual the sex, but it was not uh it was not it didn't come from it. Yes. So guys, uh so here it is we are six fourteen, so it's time for us to cease this session because we we need to get connected to the next one. So uh, we really appreciate you guys uh, being uh, present over here. And our apologies for not having uh, the interpreter with us, but uh, those things happen. And uh, our apology for my very, very poor translation on Paraguayno. But, uh, well, we, we, we did the best and uh, all the things happened. So thank you so much for your uh, support. Thank you for being with us, and um, and uh, we'll see you soon. Thank you, Dijama. Appreciate your your help and uh, you staying here with us. Eu quero agradecer a vocês e também dizer que infelizmente nós tivemos esse contratempo e eu não pude explanar diretamente muitas vezes com clareza o meu pensamento, mas Eu me coloco à disposição para responder se as pessoas me enviarem as perguntas, responder diretamente através de algum meio, como o e-mail ou uma gravação. Ok, so Djalma is, say, uh, is saying that he, he thank you all for your, uh, your contribution, your, uh, your, your audience today. And he also wants to say that he is open for any question or any message uh, you can send to us and then we can send to him uh, through email or, or something like this. Inclusive. Yeah, um, also. Eu possuo na Amazon. I have uh, in Amazon. Três livros. Three books. Onde esses assuntos que eu falei aqui. Where this, all these topics that I covered today. São tratados. Are, are, uh, are covered. So, uh, one thing that I would like to, to let you know, uh, somebody is asking me uh, how can I can, can get these videos from the conference. All the videos that will be available uh, upon or within 48 hours after the last session, of, so after today. Uh, uh, the, during the day, we are, uh, we are working with the, the, the speakers. Uh, and new material, we are recording new material for later on. And uh, so I, I just didn't have time to work on uploading the videos the, the, from the recordings that we just did. So, so hang on and uh, stay connected, keep in touch. Uh, we'll pretty soon we will release the, the videos from the conference, okay? And then we'll let you know uh, through an email. So, folks, thank you so much, and uh, see you soon. Thank you. Thank you, Dijama. Obrigado a você.